Hey lightweights and welcome back to some more Horizon Forbidden West. Um, last video we finally met Hikaru and he tasked us with um, helping one of the tribes that was kind of like falling away from the fold to bring them back in I guess. Um, he did a call to do a tournament type of thing that he does when he feels like he needs to show a unified front and one faction that was underneath him refused to join that. So he sent us to go after them so that they can show Regala that they are unified and then eventually kind of put her in her place. This video though, I am not going to be doing the main mission. I know I said that last time. Um, this video, I am going to solely focus on side missions because there are a ton of them and you guys unanimously told me you want me to do the side missions. Um, before continuing on with the main story for a couple of reasons. One, um, I saw a couple of times that there are not a ton of main missions, all things considered. So if I don't keep up with the side missions, next thing I know I'm gonna be done with the game. Um, and two, you guys are just really enjoying the side missions, so you wanna see those as well. So I'm gonna focus on side missions today because I have so many in the backlog that I need to catch up on. Um, and then we will continue with main missions as it makes sense to. Um, so maybe next video, maybe two videos from now. I don't really know. It kind of depends on how long it takes me to catch up with all of the side stuff. I also haven't done any cauldrons yet and I really, 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 really want to do some cauldrons so that I can um, take over, hijack, what are they, what's that word? Um, I don't remember what it's called, but you know what I mean. Um, get the machines on my side. Rewrite? Nope, not the word either. You know what I'm talking about though. Um, but I need to do the cauldrons in order to do that. So I want to do at least one cauldron today as well. Um, this intro was especially chaotic. So if you're still watching, thanks. <laughs> now I'm coughing out of nowhere, choking on my spit. If you're new here and that didn't convince you, you might want to subscribe to the channel, hit that bell button when you do so that you know when I post future content, which is just as good as this. All right, you guys, here we go. All right, so let's see. Oops, that's not. Um, okay, so I had come across this place that was squashed by a mudslide when I was exploring. Um, obviously, I didn't do it, but it kind of just auto triggered her saying, like, hey, I should check that out. So that's where this quest came from. So let's start with that. Where do I want to go? Because I'm curious to see what's going on there. This was a uh, scrapping contract place that I did. And they were much more difficult than the last ones. Um, for one of the contracts, I needed to do, um, I needed to get like the cannons off of a, not what I wanted, off of a Ravager, maybe? Um, and there was another contract to collect old world relics and there were Ravagers at that old world relic site, even though, um, it wasn't necessarily the location it wanted me. Oops! It wanted me to go. I hate that. That could that could use an upgrade. Okay, this story is just chaotic. I ran out of my vitamins, and I swear to God, my brain does not function when I don't have my vitamins. Okay, let me try that again. So I went to one place for one contract. I happened to have ravagers there, so I killed them, but it didn't count for the ravager contract, so I had to kill like four ravagers instead of just two because the ones that I killed did not count. And the ones that I needed to kill were way more challenging. That was that story. Survivors on that overlook. I should see if they're okay. Oh boy. Is he all right? Mm, he will be. <sighs> There. But what about the others? Let me worry about that. That Rest is now. That is some hair. I'm Natika. You're a long way from the east, Outlander. I'm just passing through. What was this place? Bleeding Mark. The last storm caused a deluge. 
that brought down half of the mountain. The mudslide barreled right through the village. As you heard, we have many missing. But I need to keep watch on these two. I can take a look around. If I find anyone, I'll send them your way. Much appreciated. And if you see an older soldier, grim-faced, goes by Kentok, tell him... Tell him I'm here. Okay. I might be able to use my focus to find any survivors. Got some burrowers. Am I supposed to go swimming? Grapple point. Let's just dive in, see what happens. Or glide in. The water feels thick. Polluted. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I see you something. Okay. Bad news. Tests are in, and officially speaking, it's a no-go. Even with the latest mining bots and extraction techniques, vapor toxicity will exceed DCE-mandated limits by 21%. But hear me out. There's a huge amount of cinnabar on or near the surface. Even after all this time, capital outlay for construction and cleanup would be well within our budget, and aerospace demand for liquid mirror lenses is trending our way. Not to mention the market for vaccine thimerosal. Overall, mercury prices are up 12% this quarter alone. I'm acquainted with a third party that can help with the toxicity data. Very discreet, very reliable, not just in line, shit fixes either, full proliferation throughout the database. She's not cheap, but well worth the cost once we're up and running. This deal is too good to give up now. Let me know what you think, Dave. So they was being shitty. Oh, found him. There. People in that tower. The question is, how does one Can get anyone in the hear tower? us? Where are you? We're trapped in this tower. Flood blocked the way we came in. There's a ladder at the top, but we can't reach it. Okay, I'll find a way to get to you. I need to get to the ladder at the top of the building. Maybe there's a way to cross over from the broken one next to it. Okay. Oh, stuck on a log. Um, um, what the hell is that? I don't know, but I don't like it. Can I? Doesn't look like there's a way to swim into the broken building. I need something to get me over the metal wall and inside. Okay. Let's get to land then. How? So, in the last game, there's something in the water I could shoot it with my bow. In this game, whenever I try to shoot something in the water, the arrow doesn't go anywhere. So, how am I supposed to kill something in the water? AKA, fishes that I need. Okay, what's happening? So they're there. What was that? A tree looks like it's about to fall. If I give it a little push, it could make a bridge to the broken building. Oh, cannibal! <laughs> that works. Now I just need to climb inside to get to the top. Should be able to cross over to the survivors from there. Oops. Nope. Oh, you turd muffin. Why? Well, shit, now what? What? Have you 
used to button mashing in Batman. I tried to button mash it. That's not what you do. Okay, take two. Can't make that. So what do I do? Oh, why? Okay, no, 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 no. Third time is the charm. Let's um do a little scanny scan. Can I pull it this way? I don't think it'll connect. Why? Hmm. Oh. I didn't see that before. Oops. Wave. There. Girl. Can I make this now? Didn't look like it, but I could. Okie dokie. Now where do I go? Over there. How does one... Get over there. Like that. Um. Okay, game. Why? I do not understand. We go. There's a ladder on the other building. I can make that jump. It looks like it's stuck. Do I kick it? I can use my weight to make it drop. Can I kick it? Yes, I can. <gasps> no! That was our only way out! Way to go! Rescue mission was a success! Everyone okay? You're not one of us. Sorry. Yes. We took shelter in here when a mudslide swept through the village, but debris blocked the passage we came in through. <gasps> Look at the little kid! It was our only way out, but we couldn't reach it from here. Don't worry. They'll find us another way out of here. Do you know what happened to the others? Before we ran in here, I thought I saw a few of our comrades climbing up a watchtower on the north side, near the grotto. I'll look into it. As soon as you're out, head for the shore. Natika's waiting on an overlook there. So she survived. Good. We'll join her as soon as we have a way out. Okay. Sit tight, for now. So we can climb that way. Or I can just do that. I hope that little kid can climb, because that's the only way he's getting out of here. Back up. Try again. We can do a little hand over hand motion. How'd you do it? Okay. 
You should have a way out. Thanks. We'll head to the shore in a moment. It didn't look like Kentok was with this group. Okay. Better find this watchtower on the north end. Uh, on the north end. Oh, that would be that thing? I'm assuming? How does one get in there? Looks like a little beaver was here. I don't think it wanted me to do that. This little guidance system is not great. I don't remember it being this bad in the last game. Like I thought it was much more intuitive last game. Like what what is that? What is that? Oh, that's the watchtower? Oh. Okay. Guess it makes more sense why the yellow dots over here. Boy. Machines. Must Shh. You don't see me? Oh, it sees me. Wait. Shh. Silence. Oh. With what? What am I crushing it with? Those boulders. Break the support beam. Crush the machines. I don't. I don't see what you're referring to, girly. Oh. oh. Well. Okay. Cool. Um. Where are my fire arrows? Okay, what part is 
awesome. Oh! There's two of them? Oh boy. Oh boy. Fruitcake. Oh, I keep whipping. <gasps> to the face. <gasps> Why are we on this? Get off. Okay, let's try out um, our tarot and see how those do. off your pieces oh oh boy oh boy oh boy oh boy oops Woo. drink this one we can oops with that. Fucking face. Oh, good. Oh, good. Pardon me, I need some healthy health. Okay. Hello. Is everyone okay? Better now, without snap moths prowling around. You sure know how to fight. We saw some of our comrades stuck on the eastern cliffs. They could use a hand too, if you're willing. Okay, I'll check it out. Have you seen Kentok? Natika asked me to keep an eye out for him. Last I saw him was before the mudslide hit. Okay. Head for the shore, on the other side of the village. Natika's there with the other survivors. Will do. Thanks again. Baby Light is just chillin'. 
staring at the camera. <laughs> Not upset, just hanging out in her bassinet, staring at the camera. Okay, listen, I know they're probably not necessarily warriors, but you were up on a high ledge. You could have like thrown rocks or something. But no, you just stood there and watched me get my ass handed to me. Hey you, Outlander, up here. We've got wounded up here. Need an easy way down. Oh. Uh, hold on. I'll figure something out. I need to find a way for the Tanakhs to get down from the cliff. That big crane could help. Why can't I shoot it? If I can get it into the right position, I could make a bridge for them. Don't mind me. You have people that are hurting, but I'm just going to take your valuables real quick. Listen. I need to get the crane into the right position. Here I come. Go. Oh. Don't know why you climb that. I rubble blocking the base of the crane. Maybe I can clear it if I pull that beam out. Something else. Underwater, maybe. My uh. focus can help me search. Oh, like some fire gleam? Swim away, Aloy. Swim away! We almost just got squished. Oh, I saw a uh, pulley thing over there. Okay, crane's in place. Now, how to lower it to reach the cliff. I should take a look at the bottom of the crane's arm. See if there's a way to move it. Looks like there's something weighing the arm down. There. If I pull out that beam, it should remove the counterweight and lower the arm. Should I go up here to do that, though? I'm feeling like they didn't put this letter here for no reason. <gasps> there we go! Oh, damn it. Arm stuck on something. I better climb up and take a look. Rejected. What is that noise? It sounds like screaming. If I could touch those cables, the arms should drop the rest of the way. Blood of the ten. How'd you manage to do that? Magic. I don't know how you did it, but thanks for the rescue. Is everyone okay? His legs snapped against some debris mm. as we were making a run for it, but he'll live. How'd you get stuck up here? A mudslide tore through the village in the last storm. This ledge was just above the flood when we got to it. And by the time everything calmed down, the water have receded, leaving us stranded, and we couldn't leave a fellow soldier behind. Can you make it to the shore from here? Natika's there, tending to the wounded. Natika. Thank the ten. We'll head for her location. She'll know what we should do next. Thanks again, Outlander. Still haven't found that one guy. 
that she was asking about? Okay, I'm just going to... Okay. I think that's it for survivors. Mm, maybe I didn't not. see I Ken talk on. among them. I should head back to Natika. I don't know. Yeah, see, the coordinates from the dot get very confused. Like, it wants you to take a very specific path. So sometimes it's more of a detriment than a help. Rest now. Aloy, thanks to you, these soldiers are safe. But where's Kentok? I didn't see anyone who matched his description. Do you know where he was when the storm hit? I was the last one to see him, just before. I told him I wanted to leave this place to pledge my blade to the chief's guard, but he refused to discharge me from the squad. All Tanakh are stubborn fighters, but Kentok is more so than most. So I walked out. I was coming back from the opposite ridge when I saw the mudslide. You were coming back to make amends. I must find him. If anyone can survive such a storm, it's him. Okay, guys, I'm going to pause here because um, Baby Light is upset now. So I will do all of these conversations when I get back. You said Kentok is your squad leader? I've trained under him ever since I was assigned to a squad. He's tough as a shell snapper, unforgiving as the desert. But my blade is quicker, deadlier because of him. And he taught me to fight for duty, not just glory. To serve something greater than yourself. Yes, and yet he wants me to be tethered to this place, rather than fulfilling a greater purpose with the Chief's Guard. You said you wanted to pledge your blade to the Chief's Guard. Is that what the Marshals are? No. The marshals travel the breadth of the clan lands, enacting Chief Hikaru's will. The guard remains at the grove to defend it and the chief. But like the marshals, only a handful are chosen for such an honor. So why did Kentok not want you to go? He claimed that the greater honor was to serve my squad and clan. But all we do here is gather supplies for ink. How can that compare to guarding the grove? The chief himself? I wonder what he's up to. So Mudslide did all this? Must have been quite a storm. We've had more and more of them over the last few years. Torrential rain, lightning strikes, winds that rattle the metal towers. But this last one was the worst yet. This area used to be as arid as the rest of the desert. The storms have changed all that. But for all this water, we still rely on the capital for our supply. Why is that? This water's poisoned by ash blood. Undrinkable as machine oil. What's ash blood? It's a red stone we gather. Our inker and scalding spear turns it into a pigment for the marks on our skin. In exchange, we get water. Every village in the clan trades with the capital huh. for it. Food, machine parts. For us, it's ash blood. It's not exactly an exciting trade. I can take another look around the village. Where did you last see? Natika. I'm here. Where's Kentok? Did he make it? We're going to find him. He saved me. Pushed me out of the way as everything collapsed. But then the flood took him. Towards the gouge. The gouge? It's an ancient past. <laughs> My question exactly. Come. I'll show you. Natika. We need orders. We're exposed out here. Only half of us can hold a blade if machines come. What do you want us to do? Go. The gouge is in the hillside, northwest of here. I'll catch up when I can. Oh, that must be this. Oh. I hope I don't need to swim underneath, cause... I'll drown!
That was a little dramatic, Aloy. Shake off. <laughs> I better shake off. Plunge. Why are there peppers growing underwater? That must be the gouge. Looks like an old mine. There's a lot of debris blocking the entrance. Maybe Kendra got swept in there during the flood. The colors in here. Take it easy. You must be Kim Talk. Oh. I was an outlander, know my name. Natika sent me to find you. The soldier you saved told us you were swept away by the mudslide. And so he made it. Good. And Natika. She came back. Yeah. She was on her way back to talk to you when the mudslide happened. She's looking after the survivors now. It was my mistake to deny her discharge. A soldier is supposed to sacrifice for the good of the tribe. Looking back now, she was right. I didn't want to let her go. The chief's guard will gain an invaluable soldier. At least after all this, won't be in the way anymore. I can tell you know a fatal wound when you see one. My service to my clan is done. So... Leave me. No. You're not going to die down here. There has to be a way to get you out. There isn't. I tried to climb out. It's no use. The walls are too slick. Water's coming in from the surface, but not from where I came in. There must be another source, and if I find it and open it up, you might not be able to move Kentok, but I think there might be a way to move you. Hey, hey, <laughs> I need you to stay awake. I'm gonna take a look around. <laughs> You're just like Natika, relentless as a fire claw. You should be used to it. Just sit tight. I'm going to get you out of here. That waterfall must be coming from somewhere. I need to get higher up to figure out where it's coming from. I hate how she kind of like gets stuck on the edge. It's nice when you're actually like jumping from beam to beam so you don't get so you don't accidentally fall off but when you're trying to leave the beam <laughs> and it gets stuck and doesn't let you it is a little annoying ooh two Again. Water's coming from that vent. Dead end. There must be another source. Listen. Let me in. How am I supposed to get that crate? Onto that. Game. 
Wow, how rude! <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just thought I w I ended up where I started. There's some metal all across the way. I that would have been so bad. Out. There. I think we can reach the other side. Oh, sorry, what? How does that help me? Oh, oops. Killed her shins. <laughs> that was a little fancy for what we were doing. Okay. The waterfall I saw down below should be coming up somewhere around here. Gotta find its source. I think Aloy isn't claustrophobic, cause... Water's coming in from there. I can use the fire gleam to break open that wall. And this whole place should flood. The Rath Kentox should go right up to the top. Glad that was a cutscene. What did you do? I found us a way out. Almost there. Hey, stay with me. Tell Natika. You tell her yourself. She said you're a stubborn fighter, so keep fighting. only to the hand that commands it. He would say that every time we sparred. Sometimes as an insult. <laughs> Other times as a compliment. But I guess he was right. It was always my choice to stay or go. I'm sorry you didn't get to make amends. So am I. What will you do now? I'm not sure. Lady Mark has a chance to recover. And once that's done... I could join the Chief's Guard, but I have to lay him to rest first. 
with full soldier's honors. Aloy, wait. You saved my comrades, somehow drained the entire village. I want you to have this. Thanks. And good luck. Whatever you decide. Does it bother anyone else they kept him alive long enough just to make it out of this thing and then he dies right there? For real. For real. Huh. Oh. Let's wear it for a second just to see. Um, it has no burn or shock resistance. Plus nine. Acid defense. Negative acid defense. Oof. So is it better to be less negative or more positive? <sighs> um, 21 to 28. 8%, 10%. Just gonna go with shock for now. Cool, all right. Oops, I'm just running over his corpse. Sorry, bud. Side. Okay. Let's see what the Tanakh they're doing in no man's land. Plasma. I don't think I have had any plasma weapons yet. Shinsakai would hate me. I've killed so many foxes. <laughs> Sorry, Jin. Sure, what's up? It's lucky for me that you're here, Outlander. The name's Jax. A squad of Tanakh is holed up in that cave. I think they're in trouble. At least one of them is injured. I'm here to offer help. But with the Tanakh, such an offer might be perceived as an insult, even when help is needed. Will you stand with me? I saw you speak before the chorus, so I know you can be persuasive. And if things get out of hand, I will be stronger with your spear at my side. I'll do what I can. That's weird tattooing and painting for the Utaru. You there! This camp belongs to Eagle Squad. Retreat or die. At ease, Eagle. I'm not here for blood. Just to parlay. You know the parlay sign? Let us in so we can talk. They Same salute? <laughs> Long way from the desert, aren't we? This one was blinded. Boy, nothing gets by you. Looks like your training mission didn't go according to plan. We're here to help, if you want it. How does an Utaro know we're on a training mission? He knew how to request a parlay, too. His tattooing clearly Utaro. isn't Utaro. Or Tenax. He must be a veteran. A veteran? I didn't think there were any left. We don't need help from a washed out farmer. Could have fooled me. Judging by the look of things. Sister. It sounds like they just want to help us. Why not let them? Oh my god, I can't stop yawning. What do we got to lose? You said you're on a training mission? A machine hunt. The final test before a young squad goes on active duty. Everything was going fine. 
We tracked a claw strider oh, and boy. hit it hard, but it fled into a herd of bristlebacks. One charge right at Corey. He dodged just in time and landed a strike as it passed. I hit an acid canister. Oh, the spray woo. was like fire in my eyes. A terrible wound. I should have scouted ahead, spotted the herd. No, I should have spotted that canister. What does it mean to be a veteran? I was born to Nox, but offered to Utaro in exchange for tribute. Oh, tribute? Back when there was plenty, the Utaru offered yearly gifts of food to the Tanakh to keep peace between them. So he's both. Over time, this tribute grew into an exchange of people. The Tanakh needed able-bodied youth to fight their clan battles. And the Utaru needed veteran soldiers to train the defenders of Plainsong. I was just such a soldier. Was being the key word. All right, you may youngin. Be my spear, young warrior. My makeup no longer matches my outfit. Supplies. I have to go change it. Dried meat, ammunition, weapons, camping equipment. A lot of provisions for a trip back to the desert. Everything we need is at River Watch. A huge cache of war spoils up there, left over from the route. The route. When our forces drove the Karja back to Baron Light, they made sure the Kestrels felt the loss, made it hurt. Marshal Canera shot a score of fleeing Karja from the top of River Watch, and her squad gathered the loot. It's all just sitting up there. Ours for the taking. Deadly machines are known to patrol that place, and the ruin itself is on the brink of collapse. You think machines and rotting ruins are enough to keep out Eagle Squad? No, but your injuries are. Let Jax and I grab these supplies for you. This is our mission. I'm not handing it over to some... Fine. Come with us. Fine. The three of you hold position. I'll be back. Be safe, sister. She's got an attitude on her. Kids these days. Just kidding. The ruin is this way. Ooh. Once we get the supplies. Everything will be fine. Thunder, Jimmy. So you say. What's that supposed to mean? Your brother's condition is... That's not your problem, farmer. So you say. Stop <laughs> saying that. Very dire. Hey, calm <gasps> down. I like him. We're trying to help, remember? So you say. <coughs> Bitch, we're about to have words. We'll have to cut across the river. Avoid the outlander camp down the road. Trespassers. There are strangers in these lands, just like you, Eagle. <laughs> oh, something wrong? I hate getting wet. Tough as a ravager, this one. I heard that. She is interesting. Haha, <laughs> I can so fast on you. I am the epitome of maturity. This is crazy. I'm gonna get out We're of here. here. The entrance should be right under that arch. Yawning. Oh, I'm leading the way now. Okay. Ooh. Quiet, quiet. I'm going in. No, Aloy won't point. Follow her lead. <laughs> no, no. No, no. I'm worried that. I wonder if there's another cauldron that could teach me. Come here. Oh, 
Oh boy. Oh boy. There's one over there, I think. Oh, there, it's back there. <laughs> I am speed. Uh-oh. 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 Woo! <sighs> yeah. You don't see me. Maybe I shouldn't go that way. Glintocks. Great. I don't know if I've scanned a Glinthawk yet. Okay, you stay over there. I'm just gonna get rid of this friend of yours. Okay, where'd he go? Oh, that was beautiful. Give credit where credit is due, young one. Maybe I would have handled it better if I wasn't busy covering you, old man. Aren't I lucky? <laughs> I like how he's still trying to like educate her and be her teacher, even though she wants nothing to do with it. Youths. I guess the farmer hasn't lost all his fighting spirit. Supply should be up there. Taller than I thought. What's a deadly climb to Eagle Squad? <laughs> what are you trying to say, old man? Enough. I've climbed this tower before. I'll grab the supplies. I have. Come. Why do they do that? These machines have parts we can strip. Maybe I'll oh. show you a thing or two. <laughs> Alright, I did that. Possibly know about salvage. Only decades of experience compared to your very brief existence. <laughs> you tell her, Jax. Okay, gotta find a way into the ruins. I'm trying to remember when I climbed this tower and what I climbed the tower for. It worked. It must have been when I was exploring, but looks like some kind of basement. Gotta find a way up. I don't remember this. <laughs> oh, I do remember this. I, oh, I'm just been exploring. Okay, the supply cache should be at the top of the tower, but how to get up there? Honey, you said we've already climbed before, so why are you asking these questions? You should already know. Hmm. 
I've done this before, but I don't remember how. Oh. That's how. Keep looking. Doesn't look like Sakura supplies. No, they're the supplies I wanted. Oh, we're stuck. Definitely did not keep going up here, though. Precisely what I wanted to do. Oh. Should go get that. I could have sworn I did all this. I don't know why all these chests are back. Not that I'm complaining. I see the yellow searchy thing, but I didn't see anything around. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. These are the supplies? Won't last them very long. I can't leave that kid alone for a second. Jax and Sakura are in trouble. I gotta catch up to them. <laughs> Going down. Okay. Let's go. I need. Oh, there's Jax and Sakura. I gotta get in there and take down those machines. Water. Oh, Cliff, good. Woohoo! Get your tongue away. Okay. 
got double got er. Ah! Ah! <laughs> okay. Whoa! You stay. Ooh. Come to my trap. I want a husk. Or a tusk? A tusk. Come here. Stop attacking. I, I want its tusk. Oh. Well, fine. It's done. Make me waste my trap. I better check on Jackson Sakura. Okay. Well fought, Eagle. Though I would have preferred if you hadn't taunted that thing. What did you find? Practically nothing. Sakura, there's maybe a day's worth of food here and some rotting medicinal herbs. There was supposed to be more. Enough for... It was never your intention to go home, was it? What do you mean? A blind Tanakh can't fight. And if you can't fight... The Tanakh will kill Korra from being blind? He'll face a trial against the machine. They say it's more dignified that way. But it's still a death sentence. The fuck? So you were gonna use the extra supplies to live in the wilds? I thought it would be enough to get us started. Can't they stay in Plainsong? Plainsong has too many mouths to feed. The chorus would never allow it. We should get back. I'll take this young sprout back. Meet us at the cave when you can. I mean... I'm sure the Osteron would take them under their wing. They could probably use some protection. Almost be like their bodyguards. How far away is this bonfire? Yes. <sighs> okay, let's fast travel here and pick up this. <laughs> I love when Baby Light wakes up and she's just like chilling in the bassinet, rolling around. She can't get onto her belly yet, but she can get onto her side. So she just rolls onto her side and then back and then side and then back. <laughs> you told me they were the best delving crew in the claim. Y you told me we'd be drowning in artifacts. Well, I found this, didn't I? It's a tray. By the sun, man. Not even the most accomplished crafters of Meridian could pull off such symmetry. I wonder what the old ones served on it. Appetizers? <laughs> It's a tray! What is it actually? Who are you? Rushavid. You wouldn't recognize the sound if it hit you in the face. This is the savior of Meridian, the one who sees the unseen. You've come for them, haven't you? Uh, them? The relics. The lake is full of them. Something big happened here in ancient times. You mind if I take a look? Okay, oh, sorry guys. Oh, that's a lot of data. <laughs> Here, may I? Um, should we be sending for a healer? Whatever this is, it all points to something called a mobile cover system. Oh, you mean a cover for the tray? No, <laughs> more like something that could come handy in a fight. Where did you find this? Uh, the dig site, uh, which is now crawling with machines. Unless they magically disappear, we are leaving. Don't you want to find out what actually happened here? Maybe we still can. What drew you to this place in particular? Every good expedition starts with a rumor. 
when the Tanakh chased our forces out of the West, returning soldiers described this lake, rife with signs of the ancients. I knew as soon as I heard the tales that its waters promise a bounty of artifacts. A promise that hasn't been kept, at least so far. Those who are patient will be rewarded with sunlight when clouds pass. I kind of like that phrase. There's plenty of ruins in the east. Why come all the way out here to look for artifacts? Ah, well, while my colleagues scour the same old ruins, I intend to blaze a new trail. Loquacious Gendas, the first scholar to discover the secrets of the West. Why, I'll be as famous as the great scribe Aram. You don't seem to share his optimism. I sell artifacts to nobles. Ideally, trinkets that are a little more glamorous than seafood trays. You can be so boorish. Somebody's got to pay for expeditions like these, and so far we haven't found anything that'll cover my costs. Definitely not upset. Not at all. So not one bit. attacked by machines at your dig site? It was horrifying. When we arrived, the site seemed as calm as a gentle breeze. I saw a glint in the water and waded in. It was the tray. I was so enamored with it, I didn't even see the machines closing in. I barely escaped with my life. I was there. You actually had a pretty good head start on them. Easy for you to say, gawking from a safe distance. In any event, I had hoped the Asaram would deal with them. They're supposed to be the best delving crew in the claim. Instead, all they do is moan about hazard pay. <laughs> <laughs> Not a chance, unless we can find some booty to cover my investment. He wants to find some booty? Not this booty! I already Look elsewhere! Machines at the dig site. That's amazing! Aloy has too many people invested in her booty can. already. Though, knowing this crew, it'll take forever for us to move. <laughs> Let's see those good-for-nothing charcoal burners try to charge me hazard pay now! Maybe don't piss them off. I'll find out more about this mobile cover system. Maybe I can figure out what actually happened to him. I knew it was no coincidence our paths crossed, Savior. Imagine what stories you'll bring us once you search the lake with your second sight. Hopefully just the truth. The sun has truly shined upon us this day. Okay, I'm gonna go turn in that other side mission that we had started now. I should go to that dig site Gundus mentioned. Look for any clues on this mobile cover system. Guys, okay. I know she didn't mean to, but she just said mama. I'm just gonna leave the microphone on and you can hear her crying for a little bit, but I want her to do it again so that I can have it on record. How am I supposed to tell them that I think? Speak the truth, plain and simple. Can you say it again, mama? <laughs> Did you hear it? Mama? The There's no Mama? point in dwelling on the past. Look forward to what you can. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's really cute. I just gave her lots of lovins. And now she's swinging in her swing. Grow from this. Every scar bears its own lesson. Aloy, we were just about to head in. So what will you tell them? That we'll have to make do. Survive in the wilds without the supplies. That will be a hard life. Better than letting Cory be killed if we go back. There must be another way. I don't see one. So, we're all stocked up then? The cache was empty. But we'll be alright without them. I can't let you starve out here. Just leave me. No! Jax, you said Plainsong has too many mouths to feed to take them all in, but what about just- I am not leaving my brother behind! 
You'll be safe in Plainsong. And the rest of you can head home. It's the only real solution you've got. The Chorus won't like it. But if I vouch for the boy, share my rations with him, I could convince them. I will do so if Korra wishes. No! You're not taking him! Sakura, I think this is the best option. I'm a burden to you out here. This is what I want. Let me go with him. Permission granted. But brother, this is not the end for us. I will visit you in Plainsong, and no Utaru or Tanakh can stop me. They will be foolish to try. <laughs> I'll stay and help them pack their gear, then take Korra back with me. You've shown strength and wisdom today. Rare combination. You have my thanks and theirs too, I'm sure. That was cute. All right, should I try? I can't do a full two hours today, but I think I'm gonna try to do a core. <laughs> See how long that takes me to get through. Where is? Mm, this might be closer. Thank you for your service. I called it a core, it's a cauldron. <laughs> oh, no, get down. We don't want to climb that. This will be over quick with frost ammo. Is that the only one that's here? Let's try to shoot its butt and overload it. Should be able to hack this open. I'm a little nervous for this for some reason. These ledges look like they'll hold up. This is like my first real culture in this game. Besides the one that I did for the main mission, but I had two people helping me. Make sure you're prepared. Okay. Thanks, game. It Here is. goes nothing. People seems story enough. Uh, maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Oh. Here we go again. Oh, she auto falls. I was falling for her. Do I take it all the way to the end? No. Oh, 
the fire to an idea. Be stealthy. This car should hide me for a while. Okay, where'd that other guy go? Um, Baby Light Swing has like owls that spin around in a circle on a mobile and there's a mirror in the middle and in, her, in the little camera I just see her staring like this straight up and I don't know if she's staring at the owls or her reflection because she's been um, just noticing her reflection. She doesn't know it's her because apparently babies can't recognize themselves until they're like over a year old or something like that. But um, she recognizes that it's another small human. So she like sees her reflection and she loves it and she giggles and it's really cute. So I don't know if she's noticing her reflection or if she's liking the owl spinning around over her head. But either way, she is enthralled. Find this my stash later. Shooting the wrong thing. Shoot. How was it cheating their bit? It's done. I have to get past the shield. So far, things are going very smoothly, and that makes me a little bit nervous. Because it's gonna hit the fan soon, I'm sure! Everything's being moved to the back of this corridor. We don't go down that way. Oh, I should be able to climb these ones. Wait till they very first open up. Definitely could have made it like three times over. Okay, at least I know they stay open for a really long time. Although it's still not stressful. <laughs> she climbs very slowly. Should be easy enough. 
Oh, should it? So far, so good. Now I just need to jump off. The yeah, that was actually pretty easy. When do I jump off? What? It didn't want me to jump from there. Okay. I wanted to jump off and glide. It didn't want me to do that. Why do I... I don't go that way, do I? There's an armor there. Wait, what? No. What the heck? Machines past that shield. I have to be careful. Oh, can I turn this off? Maybe I go down here. Oh, okay. Got a little turned around for a second. See there's machines past here? Possibly right through that little shocker. Vents. Just want to be able to see up here for a second. Acid. Attachable, attachable, attachable. Okay, it's already forgotten about me. Oh no, it hasn't. Okay. <laughs> I thought it did, but it didn't. There we go. 
finally. Not this one. Yeah, but you gotta get up first. Damn, the range on that is huge! Thought I was on the side, I was not on the side enough. shield. It always curls a little too far around the edge. Oh, she's upset now. Finally, dang. But it also wasn't horrible. Okay, I'm just gonna go get this health real quick. And now I'm turning around again. Okay, this way. Probably could have just gone by without killing it, but where's the fun in that? These metal carriers can get me closer to the core. Metal carriers? Oh, those things? These are actually the metal carriers that she was referring to. How am I supposed to get there? Though? Could try getting to that arm below. Weird. Vince, I can make that jump. This way. Okay. <laughs> okay, not good. Of course. I should be able to hit you right on this middle carrier. That was scary. This is a long ride. I made it this far. Just have to hold on a little longer. Not entirely sure where we're going. Here? I'm gonna have to get off this thing soon. Okay. I hope that was the right spot. Ooh, go, Let's go, go! go. go. <laughs> uh uh. Too 
slow. Go! Okay, but now where? Oh, this way? Am I going down? Okay. Oh. Mate. Okay. Go. Oh. Oh. I don't know where the hell I'm going. I'm just jumping on things I can jump on. How am I supposed to get there? Those metal carriers should get me to the core. How does one get on that metal carrier? make that. Uh, it's a bumpy ride. My arms look like they're about to give out. Let me get those machine overrides. It's very particular about how it wants you to go through. So I could explode that, maybe. <sighs> well, here goes nothing. There's the core. Now I just need to access it. Thirteen muscles. Yikes. What if I just do this now? That way I have supplies to make stuff. Okay, and then let's set... We know it's not good against purge water, so let's set one of those. And then... Um... Blast trap is always a good thing. Have done trip caster, but oh well. Guess I'm not getting those overrides without a fight. I mean, we knew this already. Like, come on now. Yes. Where's that part I tagged? Oh, good. There's more than one. Oh. The machines got back up. Oh, there it is. Okay, so I want to do the chain reaction for that. Woo! Let's go over to this one. Can 
Come here. Come on. Okay, shocky arrows. That was great. I should uh, have utilized that, but that's okay. I can do that with the other one, though. Nope, too far away. This is not a great bow for distance. Come here. I like how they actually like limp around when they're injured. And they have a lot of components torn off them. Okay, I'm sorry, but that was just that was just so impeccably done. Hephaestus has been upgrading the cauldron security grid. I wish I was able to take some components off, but you know you can't be picky in a moment like that. Burrower. Scrounge it. Graze it. Scrapper. Nice. Alright. That'll give me something to work on off camera. So I can actually do something. Should be able to override this machine. Should be able to override scroungers now. Yes, Aloy, you've said. Now everyone's on the same side. At least for a while. Oops. But wait, there's more! That's not the right thing. I need his butt. I need that booty. Oh boy. I was a little too close to that. I whiffed its eyeball. There we go. This one isn't mine anymore. That didn't last long. All right, guys, I'm going to stop there. Um, that cauldron was fun. It wasn't bad, but I definitely got turned around a little bit because the mechanics in these cauldrons are a little bit different than in the last game. Um, not the mechanics, but the the process of getting through them, like with jumping on the movable arms. I know in Zero Dawn we did jump on like the flying machines a couple of times, but um, the moving arms really turned me around, so that's gonna take some getting used to. Especially because I didn't know where I was supposed to jump off a lot of times, and because she was very particular about where she could jump, um, that was tricky because I thought I tried to jump, but she wouldn't let me. So I didn't think that was where I was supposed to go, but it was. I just wasn't in the right spot or at the right time. So definitely it's going to take some getting used to. But I had a lot of fun doing that cauldron. Um, that one was fairly simple, so I was probably a little bit too overleveled for it, but that's okay. I, I'll, I'll take it as a win, um, but I'm excited to do more. I did enjoy these side quests. I missed the main mission, but I do have a couple more side quests that I need to do. So next video will probably be some more side quests before we continue on with main stuff because there are some more in this area that I want to get done. Um, and then I did give myself some more to do off camera in terms of collecting pieces so I can get the full override for some of those machines. So that'll be nice and I can do that on my own time. 
Um, but I had a ton of fun and I hope that you did too. Uh, thank you for bearing with the choppiness like always. I'm so happy that I was able to get baby lights technically second since she said it first time when I was muted, but second mama on camera. That's such a big moment. Okay. Um, I hope that you enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell button when you do so to know when I post my next one. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I hope you have an amazing day.